Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, for today's video, I thought I would do something a little different. Um, it's going to be a haul, but um, I kind of wanted to do it in like a vlog style, so um, I guess I'll be open, opening the stuff now with you, but then I think throughout the week I want to show you the outfits I create with um, the clothes and like my first impressions. So I have somewhere to go today. So I'm, I've just got the packages this morning. I'm going to open them up here with you now. Um, so this is going to be super chillax. Obviously I don't have any makeup on. This is just like my real day. Like I've just arrived home and the packages were here. I'm going to open them up. I'm going to see if there's an outfit I can wear today and I'll show you guys. If not, when I come home, I'm going to like just show you how I style everything and it's just going to be real chill just like vlog kind of style so I really hope you like this video um, I'm just wanting to change the content up on my channel I've done so many hauls um, I think I said in my one of my previous videos it's my um, like my social media video it was basically I was saying how I actually did I started to not like doing hauls and I stopped shopping online altogether like I just stopped looking but I went through my closet the other day and I really decided what I needed in my life. Um, so I had a list and I went on a few online shops and Princess Polly obviously won for me. So I ordered all this stuff from Princess Polly. Um, but yeah, let's just jump on in. I'll let you guys know like my full opinions on everything. But right now we're just going to open the stuff up and then later on in the video I'll show you some styling. So let's just jump straight on into it. I have two massive ah, thumbnail. <laughs> um, I have two massive um, bags, so I did place two orders. Originally, I was just going to buy a jacket, um, so I placed that order on Sunday, and then I was like, no, I think I actually want to invest in some stuff for winter and just to change my wardrobe up because I'm kind of going through a style crisis at the moment. So, yes, first package, let's open that one up. I think this will be, I'm not sure which will be which. I think this is the first package. Alrighty, so first up, I just got some earrings, and these are the Mary coin earrings. I think you guys would have seen in a lot of my videos, I wear a um, necklace, and it's from Hunter Hunter the label, and it has a little Mary on it, but I can never find earrings to match it and I literally wear it every single day um so I bought these earrings I thought they would be bigger but they're actually kind of really cute this small so I mean the quality isn't as good as Hunter Hunter obviously um but they're still pretty cute I'm not sure if you'll be able to see these but uh focus that's them there so just little I think they're pretty cute being this small. I did think they would be bigger, but I think they will go well with the necklace. So fingers crossed for those. And I think I got these on sale for $15 or $20, I'm pretty sure. I didn't want to spend too much on them um, just because I knew the quality probably wasn't going to be as good as some of the other brands I've bought from Jewelry Wise. Now the next piece I wanted for so long and I was contemplating whether or not to get it, but after like months and months of wanting it I was like no nah, I'm gonna do it and I caved and I'm classic white girl I got the IMG teddy tote and I got it in like the camely tan nude color just because um, I was needing a jacket of this color to kind of go with all my blue jeans and oh my gosh I can't wait to wear this. I thought it would be softer. I'm not sure. Like looking at it, it doesn't, I don't know. I don't know if I really like enjoy it 100% looking at it. This one was $110 I think. I think the other colors are $120 so I was glad that this one was the cheaper option. Um, but I mean for a jacket it's worthwhile investing. The zip's not very good either. Trying to zip this down at the moment. Okay, I'm so sorry if I keep like sniffling. I have really bad hay fever at the moment. I just can't. Yeah, guys, this zipper is not coming down at all. 
so like for a 110 dollar jacket you kind of want that to work a bit better okay so i got it i'm done let me just try it up. and it's so on the inside it's got that like lining so it's not the fur on the inside i'm just looking at myself in the mirror i'm actually not sure if i like it i just don't know if i can pull it off maybe when i have makeup and a cuter outfit on but like you know how shiny grimmin wore hers in her latest video and that like looks so good i think maybe long hair would look better with it i just feel like i look like a floating head i don't know if i like this so we'll soon find out um the good thing about princess polly is you can make returns really easily so i'm gonna definitely keep the tag on this one and just um, see throughout the week if I gravitate towards it. If I don't, I'll return it. Um, you do have 30 days to return stuff with Princess Polly, which is what I love. And the returns are so easy. Unlike other online stores, which you can only get store credits from. Alrighty, next up. Wow, this, this video is going to be really long, but I'm really sorry. I hope you guys do enjoy this video. Oh, cool. I've got like a thing from MAC in here and you get to try um, some of the lipsticks. I was actually looking at buying a, a MAC lipstick from Princess Polly. I was looking at getting, I think it's Faro? Faro? Yeah, I've had Faro or either Velvet Teddy before and I really love it. Um, I also got my my nails to match a MAC lip colour that I have. So I got my nails done the other day. I can't remember the name of it, but anyways, that's just a side note. Um, I'm really enjoying that Princess Polly has makeup now, but I went to buy some makeup from Princess Polly, but I didn't know how to test it. Um, with my skin colour and obviously you can't return it so I think I'm going to go to the MAC store and get tested and then buy it on Princess Polly obviously just because I have to pay and I don't have enough money for foundation right now but um, I need some new foundation alright so I got quite a few things in the second package first up are these pants and they're just like a plaid kind of tan like almost legging and I got these um in three different um, patterns so I got this one I'm just really over skinny jeans but I still wanted um, a skinnier type of pant to wear um, so I got the plaid I got oh and these are all Princess Polly's brand now Princess Polly have their own brand which I thought was really cute I got oh this is a skirt I thought I got this I thought I got this in a pants. Anyways, a skirt, which is super cute. I thought this with just like a graphic tee and some thigh high boots would look dope. Um, again, another set of those pants. Um, the gingham ones. Oh, these feel so nice. I think these are going to be so comfy. Um, gingham. I swear I ordered three of these. So I'm going to have to double check my order because there's not three of them in front of me. Um, I got some more pants. Oh, these feel really nice, these ones. Um, these are the Battle of Evermore pants. And they're just like a, um elastic waist with a really wide leg and just like a stripe. Um, these are so cute. I just thought this with like a basic tee and like a... Baker Boy cap or something would look so cute. And in Brisbane, it's really not that cold. Well, it's cold, but it's not that cold. So you can get away with um, wearing this material. Ooh, this is so nice. Okay, again from Princess Polly's brand, this little black skirt. Um, I don't know if you can see, but it's kind of got this. Oh, I love this kind of mesh with the polka dots on it. I think it's so cute and so elegant. So I thought this with like a really... Um, I don't know, like, because this is kind of grungy but girly, and I thought um, wearing this with boots and, like, a really cute top would be so awesome. I'm loving the juxtaposition of wearing, like, a really, um, like, boy kind of, out, like, piece and a really, like, a really grunge kind of piece and a really, like, girly kind of piece. I'm loving that juxtaposition at the moment. And lastly... I got this skirt which is so gorgeous um, just another mini kind of skirt and it's just like got this um, houndstooth kind of check to it in like a mustard and navy color 
and then a gold belt, which is so cute. So yeah, that's everything I got from Princess Polly, and um, like I said further into this video, I will be showing you guys a little bit more on. Um, I think this video is going to be super long, I'm really sorry about that, hope you like it, stay tuned for more. Obviously it's just going to be the next clip, but for me it's going to be later on, so yeah, I don't know. I'll see you guys in a second. <laughs> Alrighty, so please excuse my um, already messy dressing room. If you've seen my closet um, organization video, I'm currently organizing my closet. Um, so these are the first pair of pants, and these are the ones I was most excited about. I actually really, really love these. Um, so these are the Princess Polly brand ones. These just like make your butt look so good. Um, they're not like really tight, tight. They're amazing material. And obviously I wouldn't pair it with this shirt, but I'm just like showing you, um, this is just a shirt I had on. But yeah, I'm actually in love with these so much. Alrighty, so the second pair, um, are these kind of flare or straight leg pants. And they actually zip up at the front, which I forgot about. And if you're having a bloated day like I am, literally you could just like push out and they will be undone. So, because they don't have... A, um, a clasp at the top, so that's a bit annoying. I did get these in a size 10. Maybe I should have gone a size up um, But I think they look good Other than that maybe when I'm not bloated they will look a bit better. I'm actually loving these so much They're just so comfortable And I just think with a cute like plain t-shirt like this um, And some boots would look super cute, but yeah so guys, I've just put on that IMG uh, teddy coat or teddy jacket and I'm just really not sure if I like it. The colour in real life is much different to what you see on screen. And it's more of like, in real life, it's more like orangey tones and I'm not really sure. Like obviously I wouldn't wear it with this outfit. I mean, maybe with these pants it's kind of cute, but I don't know. I'd kind of wear it with like a, probably not a black and white outfit. Um... But, I mean, it's it's so cozy, but, like, honestly, look at how much bigger it makes me look. Like, I know that's the look, but I don't know. I just feel, I really, like, I don't know if it's just because I'm, like, having a, a fat day. Like, you know, when you just, like, don't feel yourself. And so, like, everything you put on, you're, like, not sure about. But I'm really, just, let me just hold that up. Um... Yeah, I don't know. Guys, what do you think? Let me know in the comments. Keep or take back because... Or maybe even take back for the black. I think black would be easier. But then again, I'm still not sure. So let me know. Let me know. Let me know! Alrighty, guys. Next up is this skirt. Um, This is super cute. Hold on. Not making any better anyway super cute it's got that little belt detail which you can actually take off if you wish um and put another belt with it and yeah super cute um obviously i wouldn't pair it with this top but i thought with a knit and some boots it would look really cute for winter so yeah i think it's i don't know i don't know again i'm having I don't want to say the word fat. I'm having an off day. So, really not feeling my body right now. But I think when I am, I think I'll really like this skirt. And it's a good length too. And I'm, I think I'm either 5'10 or 5'11. So, I'm quite tall. And if it's a good length on me, then it's a good length on all you tall gals. Alrighty, next up is this kind of black, um, kind of almost sheer ruffle skirt. It does have a lining underneath, but I still think it's pretty short. Um, well, a bit short for my liking. I might wear it on a night out, but definitely not on a day-to-day -day basis, because, I mean, I'm showing you a lot right here. But literally, my bum line is here, and here is the end of the skirt. And obviously, because this part is see-through, um, yeah, it just makes me feel a little bit uncomfortable. But other than that, I think it's really cute. And yeah, it would look good on a really night um on a night out, but not for everyday wear for tall girls. Shorter girls, I definitely think could get away with it. And this one was in the sales section 
for $20, I think. Alrighty, next up is this um, plaid skirt. I don't actually remember buying this. I mean, I could have. I searched through the sales section, so I feel like this came from the sales section. Um, I think this is really cute, a really nice silhouette. Um, not too short, which I like. I could probably wear this on an everyday basis. And it's a bit high-waisted, so that's really good. And yeah, just this with a graphic tee. Not this one, obviously, um, but with a knit and some boots. I think would be really cute. Or I also think this with some sneakers. And just like, I don't know. A cute top would be also really cool. I'm just loving this so much. Um, and yeah, it's super easy to style something with this. Because it's just like blay, uh, blay gray black and white so yeah this is super cute alrighty next up is these um plaid pants the same as the gingham ones i'm really not sure if i like these just because the nude in it is so close to my skin color and i just feel it looks a bit um odd i'm not sure if i have the confidence to rock them either i mean the um the the gingham ones today I wore them all day today they t took a, you know quite a lot of me to wear them out in public but they were super comfy and these feel super comfy too so I'm not sure if I'll keep these or not um, I did get these pants in a striped I think that's what didn't come in my package something didn't come so. Yeah, maybe I'll swap these for the striped ones when they're back in stock. Because the reason why I didn't get them was because they were out of stock after I, like, ordered them. But, yeah, I don't know. I'm just not sure about these ones. Let me guys know what you think in the comments. But, yeah, a little bit iffy. Alrighty, guys. I hope you like this little talkative haul. Um, I know it's not the way I usually do it. But I just wanted to do something different and a little bit more down to earth. Want to be a little bit more real with you guys when it comes to hauls and trying on stuff and give you my full honest opinion and let you see it on me like on the day normally when I film hauls I pick a day where I'm like this feel the skinniest or I've got on heaps of makeup and I've had my hair and my makeup done and you know which really affects outfits so sometimes if I don't like it on me when I have no makeup on then I don't even keep it just because I wear no makeup so often um, but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this if you didn't let me know if you did let me know um, let me know what I should keep and what I should get rid of I'm really um, iffy about the plaid pants and the iron geo jacket so let me know in the comments if you did like this video make sure to give it a thumbs up and make sure you are subscribed to my channel because I have a few videos coming out very soon plus part two of my closet organizations coming very soon so stay tuned for that and yeah that's about it for me thank you guys so much for watching i really appreciate it and i'll see you in the next one bye